The auctions were always filled with excitement. You never knew all these wondrous things, and some of them would take off and fly, and you see the bidding battles. That was just exciting. Um, each time I had an auction, whether it was a firearms auction or a toy and doll auction, you brought in a group of people, and many were the same people that kept coming back. And it was like going to a, um, you know, a, 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 a reunion. A reunion, they have gone. <laughs> <laughs> every, every time I had an auction, it was, you know, a different kind of friends. And it, it, it's been such a delightful, wonderful uh, experience for me. I'm so grateful, uh, but I'm grateful so much for people like yourself. Like, you know, you're the people that I got things to sell that was so much funny. So much fun to sell the other people that came and bought and supported and did terrific. And that's the thing. I mean, I'm going to miss all of it, but I'm really going to miss that. It's like having family reunions six times a year, and now you're not going to have any more. So I miss it. I thank you sincerely, all of you, and uh, hope that I pass across, and I hope that you're all very successful and healthy. And uh, thank you very much. Okay, this is a model 1866. It was engraved by a special, famous engraver by the name of Ulrich. Well, he was one of the great engravers, and this example he actually signed. He usually didn't sign uh, his his engraving, and uh, uh, so this is a masterpiece by Ulrich. It's a model 1866. Made the first ones were made around 1866, and then they made them for a series for a period of years. But this one, its value is because of its tremendous condition. Original. See this. Basically, this was made back in 1866 or 68. And the damn thing is, you can see right now, it looks like it's brand new. You just don't find them like this. So that's what's so great. And one up here, one up here. please. Um, also, I want, I want this. This belong. This is one of the greatest Winchester collections in the world. A man by the name of Ray Bentley is a terrific guy. This is his daughter Bob, and this is his son Larry. And um, Ray passed away last year, but he was a terrific guy in the gun world back about 30 years ago. If you bought something like this, the first guy you called was Ray Bentley. He wanted the best. He was willing to pay for it, and he put together the finest collection. This is not the end of his collection. This is part one of three gun auctions. He also collected rare silver trophies like those in the showcase. That's one-tenth of what he had for trophies. Go ahead and explain to me the last item that you auctioned off. It's an air rifle, pellet gun, uh, and uh, it was worth around $100 to $200. That was all, you know, was just everybody. And the, as I said, the fellow to the f final buyer uh, used to work for me. He was my general manager for many years, and uh, uh, so he just bought it as a... Just so he could say, about the last thing I have a sold at auction. <laughs> so tell me, can you wrap it up in feelings? Like your your feelings right now, your words now that everything is settled, the dust is settled. No, uh, it's uh, uh, you know it. Uh, it's a it's a let's see a time of relief for me. Uh, my wife is ill, and I'm taking care of her, and uh, I no longer have any. Uh, responsibilities in regards to business here for after a few months I'll be all through um, so it's a relief it's uh, it's a sad thing I'll miss all of this as I explained in the final few minutes of my auction uh, I miss the excitement of the auction and the things and I also greatly miss the people people are really neat so many interesting people and um, uh, and uh, so I'll miss the excitement, I, you know, I'll just miss it. But, so it's a sad thing that way, it's a great relief, and it's also a happy thing because um, I was able to conclude my business, close it out in such a manner so that I'm in control of my life, my wife and I are fixed for the rest of our life, but I also made sure that I got enough money so that any employee that didn't get a job with the new auction company, they'll get a year's salary from me. And, uh, and uh, also the guy who bought my company, uh, he and the company, are, uh, his company are really a great company. And uh, he's just a good guy. And it's uh, since uh, the last couple of months since he's owned me, 
and I've got to know him better in his company, it's very obvious that he's a terrific outfit. So, uh, so that feel so it's it's a great relief. It's a time of sadness and it's a time of happiness. So. <laughs> Three different things conflicting.